Wait, is this... Okay, we're gonna keep going up this way, I guess. He, he's always had his... He's always had the ring on his finger. Whoa, I, I found a turtle. Maybe it's a, a tortoise. It's a thing with a shell. Well, isn't that something? It's actually pretty cute. Well, Henry, if you decide you want it to keep you company, nobody will mind. And what do I call it? Looks like a, uh, hmm, Mayhem Junior. Nice. That is peculiar. It has sentimental value. So that's a block trail. We're not going to head that way yet. We'll come back this way, I think, after. I think we have to go the other way. That looks like a Zeconia heart. I think we got to go around. I'm not 100% sure though, but I'm pretty sure we have to go all the way around. <coughs> good eye. Good eye. I'm down in Thunder Canyon. I'm not seeing that smoke anymore. It's still burning away. Try heading west from where you are. If you loop past the lake, there should be a trail that'll take you further south. Thanks. That helps. Okay, so we gotta go all the way around. Yeah, I've been on uh, I've been on Twitch a long time, so I've definitely seen uh, a lot of emotes. There we go. Come on. F five. The voice acting is great in the game? Yeah, absolutely. I agree with you. 100%. Oh, we're getting... We're getting close. What? 
Well, what are you going back to the hospital for now, man? Jesus, brother. Wait, what? How did we just lose that smoke trail? Okay, it's right there. This was their camp before. You know what? I'm lost. It's right there. How the heck am I supposed to get there? Gotta head this way? That doesn't make any sense, does it? Emo Ski is a glass maker. He has a lot of glass stuff. Huh, I'm gonna assume this is it here. Yeah, we've been trying to get Emoski out of his job for a very long time. Emoski, feel, feel free to go ahead and give yourself a caster if you want, man. Whew. Give yourself a cast so that way people know where you are and people they can go ahead and follow you if they want. Where in God's name is that fire coming from now? How many hikers go missing in the Shoshone? More than none, unfortunately, with most of them being in this area. The thoroughfare because it's so remote. Why? I found an old flyer for a missing hiker. It just got me thinking, that's all. Like how you said one day you were talking to the Goodwins and then the next you weren't. Ned Goodwin didn't get mauled by a bear or stuck in a ravine. He was just a PTSD'd a-hole who dragged his son out to do a job and realized it was a bad idea. PTSD? That doesn't sound good. Yeah, I don't know. He was in the army. He was... off. It's actually the saddest story. He was only discharged because his mother, Brian's grandmother, died. She'd been taking care of him, and Ned was the only next of kin. Damn. And you got to know Brian a little bit? Yeah. I talked to him way more than I'd talked to Ned, that's for sure. How was he at, uh, you know, spotting fires? <laughs> Better than you. He actually liked to stay in the tower.
I have no idea where this fire is now. You still think that she did it? She did something? Maybe. Where the heck is this fire at? Boy, for as dry as it is this summer, there's an area down here that's uh, lush. Oh, you must be talking about the Aspen Grove down there. Yeah, I think that's where I am. Those trees are actually one root organism. Did you know that? I didn't. Yeah, they share their water as a colony that can live for hundreds of years, even through fire. Can you believe you're actually getting paid to learn all of these amazing things? Also, uh, by what it looks like on this map, you'll be coming up on a stream that should lead you towards where we saw that smoke. Whoops. Oh yeah, there's a stream coming up this way, isn't there? It is so damn bright! Dear God! <laughs> 